This is Old Person Minecraft Videos. So you want a goat horn, do you? Come with me while I show you how to get them. Okay, to get goat horns, one of the first things you want to do is build an enclosure so that you can focus on this step without uh, the goats ramming you. Um, even if, you're, if you do hold wheat, they will not ram you. But if you're just standing still and you're not holding wheat, then they will ram you, just like they'll ram any stationary mob. So what you're doing is you're taking advantage of the fact that um, they ram into stationary mobs by forcing chickens into the boat. Okay, there goes one. So bring a handful of eggs with you. Come on. And you have to get two chickens in the boat. If you only get one chicken, as the goats uh, ram the boat, you know, they don't see the boat. They just see chickens that are not moving. Even if they're flapping their wings, it will work. But if there are two, come on, get in there. Come on. There we go. If uh, only one chicken is, is in there, when the goat rams the boat, then the, go the goat will get stuck in the boat and it will die. And the reason is because the next thing that you do here is you put in, okay, now you can knock this down because the chickens are in there. I'm in creative mode right now to just show you how this works. And then I will go over to uh, Java Survival to show the finished product. So that's how you start off. And I will now go over to uh, Survival to show the ramming, the charging corridor that I built to contain the goats. Okay, so here we are uh, in Java Survival. And here's the ramming corridor that I built to contain the goats. Um, if you look here, you'll, you'll see an increasing number of goats without horns. Those are the ones that have already dropped their horns inside of the ramming corridor. Once they drop them, I move them out because they're just taking up space. I don't know if the horns regrow. Um, I'll assume that they do not. I, you could kill them, but all you get is experience. You do not get, uh, they don't drop any goat meat or anything. This is just a narrow corridor. It's just three blocks wide. You could obviously get, uh, speed up the pro process. Do you see them? How they're like, do you hear that? You could speed up the process, obviously, by making uh, much wider and using more than one chicken boat. So here's my general setup. I have, since you have to hang out here for a while, you know, create a little room to hang out, bed, all that. Then I just put three uh, acacia gate, just so you can see what's going on. It's important to have two that open up like this. So that way you can move out the, the goats that have lost their horns. Okay, here's, there's another one. Okay, do you see it? Yeah, they've all lost their horns now. Here's that, remember I showed you in Creative, here's that little contraption right here with the acacia logs. I end up extending the acacia roof all the way that way, just make it look nicer. You do have to build quickly because you can't hold the wheat while you're building, obviously, and they will keep budding into you. So just keep an eye on your health. Make sure that they don't completely kill you. I need to move out the goats. They're taking up space now. The, the wall right there. Okay. Come here, babies. Come on. Come here, babies. Oh, the adults are getting in the way, aren't they? Okay, here they come. Here they come. Okay having oh no you did not just go over there i did not oh that's because that's there okay <laughs> so think about that yeah because i had the glass up higher um okay so i got the three little babies in here so you kind of need a three block depth here to get 
two blocks between yourself and them on that side to make sure that they come in when you're uh, holding the wheat. Okay, I run through there. See him? I'm going to see if I can get him to come in. And now, come on, guys. Out. I don't want you anymore. Everyone needs to come out here. Come on. out this way okay and like I said you you can just kill them if you want but whatever I like having lots of goats around I think they're kind of fun okay so where the baby goats are here now y'all can run around keep your ram start ramming and again when they charge now when the baby charges watch this okay you'll see I got Hopefully they don't try to charge me. Okay, do you see that? I'm trying to move around so they don't charge me. So the babies obviously will charge the boat and just hit it. They don't have any horns anyway, but they're too small. Once they're adults, then they're going to hit these blocks here. Now, I don't know how many weeks you have to give to make them grow up faster. I'm running out of wheat. I'm not going to do any more. So I'm going to hang out here until these two guys grow up so I can breed them. Whoa! It's much better to have them charging a stationary mob that you force to be still, you know, like with a boat, than yourself. <laughs> That's how I first started off, thinking I can move out of the way fast enough. Yeah, not going to happen. And I saw some other videos where people are using pistons and things like that to put up walls. but They're just overly complicated. And if you watch my videos, you know, I like to get, I like to keep things simple. I, I don't, I don't do elaborate redstone contraptions and all that. I, I just do real simple stuff. Okay. But obviously, if you want to, you could probably turn this into a larger farm with redstone. Okay, come on. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Dudes. Okay, let me just, okay, let's see, come on. And it is a waiting game. It takes a little bit of patience. And obviously you have to be here or working, you know, in the nearby area. Otherwise they just go stop moving. I mean, that's the thing with all of the, the farms, right? That you have to be in the area. It's not like when you go away a certain number of blocks or you log off that they keep working. <laughs> okay, come on. I just want to get one more horn. See if I can get the other kind. The number four, the fourth type. Come on. Put that head down. You can do it, bad dude. Come on. Wait, look, okay, another one just grew up. Okay, so now we got three adults with the potential to uh, drop a horn. So our chances are just increased a little bit there. And, and if you want to, obviously, you can make this into a much larger farm. You know, you could have like a row of chickens and boats, you know, 10 blocks long have a much larger space, do a lot more breeding of the goats. Okay, here it goes. Oh, good. Did you see that? Awesome. Okay, where's my wheat? Okay, so you saw that? Okay, I just want to hold the wheat to keep myself safe. Okay, what do we get here? Seek. Okay, so that's the fourth one. Wouldn't it be so cool if you could use the horns to like go blow them in the face of the, like a mob and makes them blow up? Like. <laughs> or you just use the sun. The sun. <laughs> that was kind of funny actually. 
Did I just get another one? Oh wait, there's another one. Oh, I'm getting. Oh, there's two over here. Oh, I know. Stop it. Stop it. I'm getting out of here. Okay. How? Oh my God. Seek. So I got an extra seek. Seek. Feel. Seek. Okay. So it looks. Like, I think I almost have like three of each. Go into all this. My loot. Look at all my horns. Feels my favorite one. Can y'all hear that? <laughs> I have no clue. So that is today's video of how to get goat horns. Um, the easy way, the way an old person does it. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and please subscribe. See you next time around. Bye.